all to the fifth lecture in uh, spinning mill cost yarn costing today our topic is uh, to determine the cost of uh, blended yarn uh, polyester cotton blended yarn is what we are going to see uh, the blending is done through blow room blending let us see what is blow room blending uh, blow, in which we will see the process flow chart of a polyester cotton yarn and it is a combed yarn the first is the cotton line 100 percent cotton uh, because cotton has to be cleaned well uh, as it has trash content uh, the polyester does not have trash, con trash content so a separate first cotton line is uh, processed wherein uh, the varieties of cotton are mixed and fed to the blow room and then the carding process and the pre-comber process happens and after that the combing process uh, so all together a clean combed material is got this material is fed to the next blended blow room line uh, along with the polyester and the other processes are happening as usual the blended blow room line uh, shown in pink uh, will have an open settings for blow room and carding and there will be very uh, less generation of waste uh, compared to that of cotton cotton blow room line uh, will have similar to 100 percent cotton process till you have the combed and then after that the blended blow room and carding will have very open settings as the material is very clean the only need uh, for this is uh, uh, uniform blending so next we will go into the costing for this uh, um, blended yarn by blow room blending let us look into the given data uh, the count of yarn is the first data the count of yarn is 60 is any then the blend ratio for the first cotton fiber cotton fiber blend ratio of 60 percentage and next is the polyester with the blend ratio of 40 next we have the cost of the material so we have cotton cost per kg is 160 whereas the polyester cost per kg is 90. Next, let us uh, go into the uh, waste particulars along with the revenue through waste or uh, selling price of the waste is given. So, we have the uh, department waste percentage and cost per kg. First, let us look into the uh, cotton line. I have given the cotton line in gray, uh, green color as you have observed it. The uh, various processes in the uh, cotton line are blow room card pre comber and comber and the waste percentages respectively are 4.5 for blow room 5.5 for card and for pre comber and comber it is 17 percentage and the selling price of the waste are 28 card 35 and pre comber and comber together the waste selling price is uh, 65 Next, let us go into the uh, data for uh, blending. So, blending, the, here it is polyester cotton blending, blended at a ratio of 60-40 as we have already seen in the question. Next, uh, the blend data are first the blow room wherein there is a waste percentage of uh, 0.1 and the waste selling price is 10. And next is your cart. Here the waste is 0.1 as I already said you can observe that the waste percentage is higher in the cotton line 4.5 and 5.5 uh, whereas in the blended line the um, waste percentage is only 0.1 percentage as it is open settings and the waste selling price is also low because uh, it is a blended line as polyester is a uh, cheaper material compared to your cotton. Next. Uh, Next is the uh, departments, draw frame 1, draw frame 2, speed frame and ring frame after your carding. Uh, the soft, it, it is given separately because the soft waste is collected totally and it is 2.5 percentage and your hard waste is 0.35 percentage. Uh, 
similar to your uh, uh, draw frame blending here in this uh, problem in your blow room blending also this soft waste this soft waste is used in the blow room of the blended line so we take the cost of this material this material blended material to be found out and that cost is to be assumed earlier in draw frame blending it was easier because we took the polyester uh, cost as the cost for the soft waste here we have to calculate the uh, cost of soft waste um, assuming it to be the cost of the blended material uh, that is given as input in the uh, second blow room line or the blended blow room line so we'll see that uh, later and next are the cost particulars here the various cost particulars are conversion cost to 1.8 rupees per count per kg and profit of 5% and it is on cost. If it is given profit 5% then it is nothing but your percentage on cost. If it is mentioned as percentage on selling price then it has to be taken as selling um, as a percentage of selling price. If nothing is given then it is to be assumed as percentage of cost. First let us uh, look into the uh, cotton line calculations this is forward calculation the cotton input is give assumed and then we are finding the output and waste and also the revenue through waste in this calculation so this is the tabulation that you have to put so we have the departments from the question we can uh, enter the departments so we have blow room card pre-comber and comber together so we have the three departments blow room part pre comber and comber and next the waste percentage and cost per kg has to be entered in that so the waste percentage is 4.5 5.5 and 17 and cost per kg respectively 28 35 and 65 this has to be entered so waste percentage 4.5 5.5 17 and waste selling price is 28, 35 and 65. These are the data given in the question. So first uh, we are going to assume the input to blow room as 100 kgs. So this is the assumption which we do. So 100 into 4.5 you get the waste kgs as 4.5 kgs. Next is the output in kgs. 100 minus 4.5 we get 95.5 and next uh, is the revenue through waste. So waste kgs into waste selling price you will get the revenue through waste 28 into 4.5 is 126. Hope you have done till this. Next. So the output of blow room is your input to card 95.5 the same 95.5 has to be entered here and next we have the waste percentage as 5.5 percentage so 95.5 into 5.5 you get 5.2525 as the waste generated in kgs and then the output is calculated by subtracting the waste from the input so 95.5 minus 5.2525 you we get 90.2475 so this is the output of card now let us calculate the revenue through waste we have waste as 5.2525 kgs and waste selling price as 35 so 35 into 5.2525 is your revenue through waste which is 183.84 next let us come to the combined uh, input output and waste calculation for pre comber and comber all together the input is uh, to comber pre comber is your output of card so it is 90.2475 into 17 percentage waste you get waste in kgs 15.3421 and next uh, the input minus waste 90.2475 minus 15.342 we get 74.91 so this is the output of the combed sliver which is to be sent for blending next is the revenue through waste from your comber uh, noil 
and the soft waste in your um, precomber. The selling price is 65, the waste generated is 15.342, so it is 997.23. Now, you, we have to add the revenue through waste together, we get the total of 1307.1. So, this is the re revenue generated through the waste material. So, as it is cost, I am putting this in uh, red color. So, and also this is cost, but since it is used in calculation, I am not putting here. So, this is the revenue through waste. The next, uh, we have the input to be sent to the second blow room line as 74.905 kgs which is the output of the comber here and next is our uh, waste re revenue that we have calculated here so this is this is the finding out of this calculations so these are the two calculations let us go into the next calculation let us now calculate the uh, polyester that is to be fed in the uh, blended blow room line. We know uh, the, uh, for the 100 kgs of cotton, the amount of uh, cotton that is coming out of the comber is 74.9 kgs. And from the blend ratio, let us try to calculate the total kgs and then the polyester kgs that is to be fed. So, uh, so this calculation is for... Uh, estimating the polyester that is required to be fed in the second blow room line. We know that cotton uh, uh, blend percentage is 60 and the cotton kg is 64. So, the uh, blended kgs would be 124 that is uh, 74 divided by E60 into 100 is your total kgs. And next is the polyester. So, polyester, uh, when the 60 percentage is 74.9 kgs, total kgs is uh, 124, then you can simply um, um, subtract 124 minus 74.9, you get the polyester kgs that is to be fed. And the uh, total, let us calculate the cost of the blended material. We know that cotton cost per kg is 160. So, uh, 160 into 74.9, we get the cotton uh, amount 11,984.87. And next is the uh, polyester. So, polyester is 90 kgs, 90 into 49.937, that is 4494.326. So, the cost of the blended material is the total sum of 11,984 and 4494 polyester uh, cost. So, the cost of the blended material that is fed inside the second blow room line is um, uh, the total cost of the material is uh, 16,479.11. Next, let us go into the calculation for the waste and the blow room line. So, the in material that is fed in the blended blow room line is 124.84 kg. Now, next is the blended line uh, input and the corresponding output and revenue through waste is what we are going to calculate. So, these are the columns that we have to enter. So, the departments we have. First, let us look into the three departments. Uh, first two departments, gold, blow room and card. We have the input as 124.84. We already know the waste percentages and the waste selling prices from the question itself. Uh, let us look into the question. We have the um, uh, waste percentages uh, given in this uh, uh, violet color. Um, blow room card 0.1.1. And the waste selling price is 10 rupees. So, let us enter the same here uh, and calculate. So, the input here is, so the waste percentage for blow, waste in kgs for blow room is equal to 124.84 into 0.1. So, we get 0 
and into 10 we get the revenue through waste so it is 1 rupee 24 248 and next is output is a waste input minus waste so we get 124.72 next is carding this output is the input to the card the same 124.72 to calculate waste multiply that 124.72 into 0.1 you get 124717 so this is the waste in kg so input 124.72 minus waste in kgs we get the revenue through waste and the output of this card is 124.72 minus 0.1247 we get 124.59 so this is the revenue through um, this is the output and the total revenue through the waste is the, I'm highlighting in a different color. So we have the revenue through waste as uh, through the blended line. In the first two processes is this much. So let us now go into the next uh, calculations because it is given in a combined form. So the uh, revenue hard waste and soft waste calculation because the soft waste and hard waste are given as a total value. Let us look into the question. So, you can find in this question, draw frame 1, 2, speed frame and ring frame all are given together soft waste 2.5 and hard waste 0.35 and the hard waste selling price is 35 and the soft waste is utilized in the blended blow room line. So, first let us calculate the um, waste kgs. So, the columns are department. So, we have all the four departments together. The, in the question soft waste percentage and hard waste percentage are given. So calculating uh, soft waste percentage, we have the input to the draw frame is 124, this value 124.59. So, 124.59 into 2.5, you get 3.11. So, this you will get. And next, 0.3 into 124.59 divided by 100 you get the waste kgs so we have we have got the uh, weight of soft waste and weight for hard waste next let us look into the output of the uh, ring frame so we have two ways and we have the uh, output from card is 124.59 minus 3.11 minus 0.47 you get this value 121.10 so this is the production or ring frame output in kgs so this is the yarn produced now let us uh, go to the cost calculations totally it is 0.35 not 0 0.3 0 0.3 uh, as it is there in the question, so it is uh, given as uh, 0.35. So, 0.35 into the, the input, so input, which is 124.59, uh, uh, the output of card. So, 124.59 into 0.35, you get the uh, hard waste as 0.244 kgs and next is the output of the uh, uh, ring frame 124.59 minus 3.11 minus 0.44 you get the output as 121.04 kgs is the ring frame output so the ring frame output is 121.04 so next, uh, let us go into the hard waste calculation uh, value, revenue through hard waste. So we got hard waste as 0.44 kgs and the selling price of the hard waste is 0.35. We already have that in the question. You can see here the it is 0.35 and point, I'm sorry, 35, 35 into uh, 0.44 you get the revenue generated through hard waste as 15.26 so next we will do soft waste calculation soft waste calculation 
So what is the revenue generated through soft waste? So this is very important and a different calculation here. It is an estimation. We are calculating the material uh, cost at that point of blending. We have clean cotton and the polyester is fled to the second blow room. Uh, clean combed cotton. So we have many waste material that has been gone out and a very clean combed cotton material is uh, fed into the second uh, blow room line or blended blow room line. So as we are using this waste in that particular point, soft waste is used in the second blow room line, blended blow room line. So we are estimating the cost of that uh, clean material at that point. So for that estimation, we know already cotton input is 100 kg there in the cotton line and the cotton cost that is spread in the 100% cotton line is uh, 1600. And the waste revenue generated through cotton in after the process. See, we have uh, in the in the uh, blended process we have so we have calculated the cotton uh, output to be seventy four point nine zero five, and the revenue through waste is uh, one three zero seven point zero seven. So this value I'm. Uh, putting it here so we get the uh, the output as 74.91 kgs so from this we calculate the clean material total cotton cost at second blow room so cotton cost is actually uh, 1600 minus 13,007 but for how much kgs only 74 kgs there it was 100 was fed and it is converted to 72 so the cost per kg becomes 14692.93 divided by 74.91 as 196.5 next we have the polyester so polyester cost per kg is 90 and the polyester fed at that point is 49.94 kgs Cotton 74.91 and polyester 49.94. We have already calculated this in this area. We can see 100 percentage cotton, kgs of cotton, total kgs of material and the polyester kg. This is what I am entering here. 74.91 polyester kgs 49.94 and the total kgs is... Hmm, so we will estimate the polyester cost and then go for the total cost. Polyester cost and fed at the blue room line is 49.94 into 90. We get 4494. So the total cost of uh, uh, polyester and cotton is the sum of 14692 and 4494. The cotton, clean cotton cost plus the polyester cost which is 1918. 187.25 and so the cost per kg of the mixed material is this much 153 we have arrived at this by dividing 19187 divided by the total which is this total which we have found here this total I'm highlighting 124.84 or the sum of 74.91 plus 49.94. We get 153.69. So, the, rev uh, the soft waste that is generated, we have already calculated as 3.11. So, the revenue through soft waste is to be 78.72. into 3.11. You have got this. You can re we can recheck this answer 153. This line I'm highlighting in green. I'm highlighting in blue color. This we can uh, check once more by uh, um, whether it is, it is it should be an weighted average actually. So the clean material cost per kg is 196.15. We have already found this one, and you have blow room. Blow room is already 90 rupees. We can check here also again this divided by this is 90. Again, we have this is 90 rupees. So, 
So we can check whether it is the weighted average is right, which is equal to this into 60. So this is 60 percentage material plus this we, we have this in 90 into 40 percentage. Oh, I'm sorry, 40 percentage. So we can check the answer. So we get this one. So it matches. So we have got the right answer. So weighted average of clean material and a blue room uh, uh, polyester line is 153.69. So and 153.69 into 3.11 is your revenue through soft waste. So this is the calculation for uh, soft waste estimation so we have arrived at the soft waste. so we have already got all the cost data i'm highlighting once again the cost data alone so estimation of soft waste costs already estimated the we have estimated the revenue to hard waste it's already estimated and then we have estimated the revenue of uh, the material through uh, the blended line. I will show you, minimize and show you already blended line as this one total. This one and and we have cotton that is given as input. The revenue through co cotton waste we have. And we have the cost of uh, cotton uh, and polyester. This is the cost data that we will use further for the cap cost calculations. Let us go into the calculations for cost. Final cost sheet. First. This is the cost sheet that we are going to see. Raw material cost is the first cotton uh, 16,000, polyester 4,494. 4, we have already here, we have the data, and the total is this one. Then we will go to the waste revenue. Blow room waste, card waste, and pre comber waste. We have these values. We have already got this value. You can check here this value, the same value which is shown here. So, this value is the one which I put it here. I didn't highlight so this value. Cotton waste. This revenue, this revenue, this revenue, I'm again putting it in detail so that you will have the all the data. So raw material cost, waste, revenue through cotton and next is the waste revenue through mixing, blow room and card 1.25, 1.25 and the revenue through hard waste and soft waste all the four we have so the first two from this table we have got this table 1.2424 and then soft waste hard waste revenue and soft waste revenue all these four are put here to get this sum Value we have and highlighting raw material cost, waste, cotton waste, then blended waste, and so the total revenue through waste is 1307.07 plus 496.48. So this is the revenue through waste. So total cost of raw material is. 
20,494.33 minus the revenue from waste, we get this value 1803. 20494 minus 1803, you get this value. And the yarn produced, we have calculated already in ring frame as 121.04. So the cost per kg of raw material is 18690.77 divided by 121 during frame production is the cost of raw material. So this is the first thing we have calculated cost per kg of raw material. So we have the raw material price. We already know the conversion cost from the question to be 1.8 rupees per count per kg i will give the unit in black color and the count is 60s any so we have the conversion cost per kg to be 108 1.8 into 60 you get 108 rupees per kg then total cost of production is raw material cost plus conversion cost so we get the plus this conversion cost you get 154.42 plus 108 you get total cost per kg to be 262.42 Profit, we already have in the question. Profit, as I said, it is a percentage of cost, 5% on cost. I'm highlighting. So, this one, you put it here. Profit on cost to be rupees per kg. So, the selling price becomes. Two seventy five point five four rupees per kg, and we have GST now currently at two point five percentage. So the state and central GST would be two point five into two seventy five point five four six point eight eight. So including GST, the cost final cost is this much. We have this as our final cost of the final selling price not cost price of the blended yarn to be 289.31 including dgst hope we have understood let me give a uh, overall picture first we had the given data for cotton polyester data and cotton processing in green and blended processing in the violet color and the cost details then first is the cotton uh, revenue through waste calculation 100% cotton processing that was the one which we did and found the output for 100% clean combed output kgs and revenue through waste next is the calculation for the uh, polyester kgs that is required so we are estimating this and finding the polyester that is to be fed to the blended line so the total material and the blended line waste is found blended waste and the revenue through blended waste after that the soft waste and hard waste calculation for the blended line after carding and revenue through waste hard first revenue through hard waste and then it's revenue through soft waste is given and then the final cost calculation first raw material cost waste cost waste mixing and the total revenue through waste finally we have the total cost of raw clean raw material total clean cost of raw material this is termed as rmc in the citras service and yarn produced this one not this one this 
this is the value and this is per kg and then conversion cost, total cost, profit, selling price and the final cost. Thank you.